uh, the BJP's uh, Chandan Mitra and Congress's uh, uh, Dr. Abhishek Manu Singhvi. Thanks both so much for joining us. Dr. Singhvi, first to you, the strong allegations the BJP is making, sir, even going uh, to the extent of calling the CBI the Congress Bureau of Investigation, they, of course, cite the instances of Mulayam Singh Yadav and Mayawati where there have been surprising turnarounds, as it were, uh, by the CBI. Where is the question of the Congress being involved in this? After the Supreme Court order, for seven months, the CBI painstakingly investigates. No role of the central government, no role of the Congress. Ultimately, the report has to go to the court. The CBI, towards the end of its investigation, finally makes a draft proposed charge sheet. It adds details about everybody as they go along. It's not only about Amit Shah, there are so many other accused. Ultimately, when the time comes, they ask Amit Shah to come and respond to summons. And if Amit Shah had gone and produced some startling responses, the proposed charge sheet against him might have been changed. He doesn't go there. He does three strange things, which the Criminal Procedure Court doesn't permit for any accused to do. He says, please look at my lawyers I'm sending them, as if the law permits the CBI to interrogate lawyers and not the accused. He then says, please uh, b b give me a, a questionnaire. Who, which law permits him to do this? Having avoided the summons and not gone to the CBI, he goes around and has press conferences. Right. He gets his mentor, Mr. Modi, to get the entire top brass of the BJP to have a press conference, directly to impede, right. to uh, pressurize and to intimidate the ongoing CBI investigations under a Supreme Court order. Right. You, you're, of course, saying, uh, the Dr. Singh, that things may have been different uh, had he responded to the CBI earlier. Uh, Chaman Mitra, respond to that. He's been missing. He's not responded. He went uh, underground. Could things have been different had he complied? Well, I'm astounded that a uh, lawyer of such uh, stature as Dr. Singhvi is saying that the CBI charge sheet would have been changed had um, Mr. Amit Shah have been able to produce some credible defense. Now, the fact that a 2000 word, uh, word uh, page uh, charge sheet was presented to Mr. Shah within 24 hours of his being summoned just shows what the CBI was up to. It is exactly, the script has unfolded exactly as the BJP had suspected. Right. We knew that the whole thing was timed to just be brought to this dramatic uh, you know, arrest on the eve of um, the parliament session. Right. The attempt is to completely derail parliament and avoid discussing price rise India's humiliation at Pakistan's hands, Maoism and right. other issues. Right. Is exactly what attempt. the Congress wanted right. and CBI played. Along.